now, Jim, I don't know about you, but I smell something yummy cooking up. I'll tell you what, bonefish mm -hmm. don't taste good, so hopefully they're doing something like some yellowtail snapper or something like that, mm -hmm. something that tastes really good. That would be good, so why don't you, why don't I say, let's talk with Rick down in the Keys. Rick, what you got cooking down there? Thank you so much, Bree. We're here with Chef Dario. You know what? What a beautiful evening we have here in the Florida Keys. And certainly when you got a chef like this doing the cooking, hey, I've got to come and visit you at the restaurant. Where do I go to look for you? Uh, my marker 80 at the Ultramar Ristorante. It's an Italian restaurant in uh, the America Resort. Now it looks like you've got a uh, yellowtail snapper on the menu, so what are we going to do with it tonight? Oh, the yellowtail snapper, uh, it's a Florida Keys fantastic fish all the year round, and we're basically going to treat it nice. We're going to take a little bit of salt, a right, little bit of pepper, all right. We're going to pass it through a little bit of semolina. Now what is semolina? Semolina is a less glutinous flour, uh -huh. uh, basically a durum flour. Right. That is a little bit more coarse, so it has a little bit less gluten, not so starchy. It just gives it a little bit of crispy taste to it and texture. All right. Now you got something sauteing in here, Chef. What is that? Oh, that is a little bit of uh, peppers, onions, and garlic. We're going to deglaze it a little All bit of white thing. wine. Yeah. All right. We're going to get some nices into it. Right. So, so I'm not real familiar with that. What does the white wine do to the taste, and why do we use white wine in so many different recipes? White wine, we're adding flavor and depth into it, and we're also trying to get all the caramelization out of the bottom of the pot, all right, so nothing goes to waste. All right, all right. so after that? After that, we basically add a little bit of water to it, just to cover, uh -huh. all right, everything is underneath. We add some fresh thyme. Looking good. A couple of bay leaves for good luck. Right? And uh -huh. basically, we just let it simmer. When it's ready is when the peppers are nice and tender. Right? And then you can put it in the blender uh, for, I would say, two minutes, and it should come out something like this. Oh, nice so this is that finished, cooled, as well as blended. Oh, yeah, season everything. You always want to add a little bit of love, the salt and pepper. You oh, can always add so a little good. bit of hot sauce. You want to substitute the wine for beer, that's fine with me. So let me ask you something, Dario. It looks like you have a V there. That insinuates that you cut out the bloodline. Do you suggest you do that with all the fish? Uh, some fish you might want to. All right? it, it all depends on the taste. Like tuna, you always want to take it out. Right. Uh, swordfish, um, yellowtail, as long as it's really, really nice and fresh, it's not as, as, as strong and pungent as every other fish. Uh, but you want to clean it as much as you can. It's a nice, clean tasting fish. All right, so because of the beauty of TV, this is our finished product, but what are we serving it over? A little bit of broccoli rabe. Broccoli rabe is going to take some of that sweetening of, of that fish because it's a, little bit, it's a little bit bitter, and it's going to balance it out. And then you get a little bit more sweetness out of the pepper uh, sauce. So what kind of wine would you want to have with this? You want to stay into a little Chardonnay, a little bit sweeter, kind of light, not go too heavy red like I would because that's just my kind of taste. All right, now if any of our viewers of the Chevy Florida Insider Fishing Report want to come see you, where do they come? At Mile Marker 80 at the America Resort and the Ultramar Restaurant. Thank you so much for being with us here at the Postcard Inn in the beautiful Florida Keys. 